we'll have to see how he gets on with these tight corners, but uh, it should be okay. I tend to go this route, uh, this route because uh, the other route is quite tight. There we go. Okay. So I think... Don't we have to put pause here? Because it didn't unload last time. Let's put a pause in there. Hmm. It was a little bit funky last time I tried doing this, so... Let's see. Uh, let's go back up to the field. Without crashing into anything. <laughs> So what we're trying to do is automate him picking up all the straw um, and then at six meters uh, auto width and then take it back straight to the TMR station and then come back and then carry on. So that's what we're trying to uh, trying to sort. I'm hoping that that pause worked. It's the only dodgy bit when you're doing something like this. So there we go. And then we press stop. And then we're going to save this as uh, straw... Field 10 dash 2. Uh, uh, 6M. There we go. Save. Right, clear that. So, what we're going to do now is go to here uh, under straw. Here we go. So, number one, we load that one. And uh, I, didn't, I didn't put an unload bit. Let me try this. That and then the straw number two, add it. Uh, so, where do we left? Uh, we left off over there. So, if you bring this up, I think we were just on this corner here, weren't we? There we go. So, next closest waypoint. No, that's not the right one. Is that picking it up? No. The reason why it's not picking it up is because I didn't select uh, field work. Okay. So here we need to select field work. Uh, there we go. There we go. It's starting to collect it now. I don't know whether it's going to work. We'll have to see. Uh, what you got the long way around? There's a road by the silage pits. Uh, what road? Oh yes, I know. Uh, yeah, the little yeah. I don't know. It's just easier with a bigger uh, bigger trailer, I think, uh, to go the long way around. I don't know. It's a little bit neater. So fingers crossed that will work. Don't know if it will. We'll see. Right. Um, you need to load in. Where are you? You're over there. Uh, I hope it works. Oh, me too. Yep. Making a fortune from poop. We are, Davy. Uh, Davy boy. We uh, we're making an awful amount, of, a silly amount of money on uh, on waste. You know. I think there's a saying, isn't there? You know, whenever whenever there's muck, there's money. And uh, yeah, for sure, we're, we're certainly we're certainly making money from muck. Oh, the amount of water! Grab me next bottle. Uh, 
Okay. Uh, look for the windmill. That's my way out. <laughs> Let's offload this. Uh, one man's waste is another man's treasure. Davy boy, you're not wrong. Uh, brown gold. That's <laughs> it. I like that. Brown gold. Uh, so what I'm, what I'm hoping for is not a massive um, pile of straw at the uh, TMR station. So I'm keeping an eye. You can see that the straw is at uh, 23%. So when that gets close to 100, we'll watch him. And, uh, yeah. Exactly. The bigger machines, on, 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 somewhere on this map, we have to be a little bit careful about how big we go with the machines. And, uh, oh, Sloth Farms with a raid of six. Thank you so much, Sloth. I really appreciate that. Our second raid today. Man, everybody give some love for Sloth. Hey, mate. How are you, buddy? I enjoyed your stream earlier. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for the raid. I appreciate that. Welcome, everybody. Ah, oh, very nice of you. Thank you. Uh, Kek, how you doing, buddy? Thank you so much for the uh, for the bitty. Welcome. I appreciate that. Kexus, is it? Kexus. Thank you. And he's with a follow as well. Thank you, buddy. I appreciate the love. I really do. Uh, raid. Oh. Thank you, sloth. I appreciate that, buddy. Uh, big Lester with the host as well. Gosh, thank you so much, mate. I appreciate it. And uh, Poojan with a follow. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. Guys, awesome. I appreciate the love. And uh, we got uh, Big Lester with a bitty. Thank you, man. Soko, uh, it got a lot worse after you left. Oh, did it? <laughs> There's some, a lot of love being shown to Sloth, which is great. He deserves it. And we've got Matt. Matt with a, with a host as well. Matt, thank you so much, mate. Matt Rivet, thank you, mate. That's uh, that's lovely of you. Uh, love from India, bro. Oh, Pujan, thank you, mate. Love from the UK. I hope you're well and staying safe. I have uh, a few friends over in India, sort of work colleagues, and... Uh, uh, I'd love to visit India one day. That's it's definitely on my bucket list. Um, Alright, he's doing that. Let's turn you off. Okay. Let's get you back. Uh, we're going to get a wind row. And uh, we're going to row the uh, the boat. No, no. The, uh, the grass. That's what we're doing. Yeah, it wasn't very PG. No, no, no. I understand, Big Lester. Oh, oh gosh. Uh, I, to I was talked about this earlier. I've been... P my channel and I have been PG since I started YouTube. All those many, many, many moons ago. Uh, over 10 years. So it's, it's something that uh, I've always done. Um, I have a lot of uh, a lot of followers and a lot of people watching who are, um, you know, under 18. And, uh, yeah, so... But not only that, I'm not a massive, you know, I'm not, I don't swear very often anyway, so, uh, it comes fairly natural. You just replace swear words with things like, oh, you little toad, and other things like that. You don't tend to, uh, don't tend to swear. Ah, feeling good to hear that. Uh, do come over after this. Yes, Pooja, yes, I will, I will try my very best, mate, try my very best. No, you're not being too bad, Lester. No way, mate. No, 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 no way, no way, no way, mate. I, I, I you know, I go to uh, you know Johnny's and uh, Mr. T stream as well. Uh, so uh, if I was a prude, I certainly wouldn't be hanging around in those channels. <clears throat> oh, look at the red heap of sc scrap uh, finished up finally. It looks very nice, doesn't it? it looks very nice and new. 
got to keep Bruce, uh, Bruce's favourite tractor. We've got to keep this uh, nice and clean, for sure. <clears throat> yeah, sucker's a nice person. I am. <clears throat> Excuse me. Hang on one second. There we go. There we go. I'm back. Um, oh, thank you. I am. Uh, don't forget, we're going to have a bit of a drinking session going on uh, at the end of uh, end of April, Wednesday the 29th. So, uh, yeah, you may see a different side of me, peeps, you know, with a few cans in my... Oh, no, no, stop. No, reverse. Uh, with a few cans inside me. So, definitely, uh, to celebrate the end of Oakfield Farm on the, uh, on the stream, we're all going to have a few beers. Oh, wrong button. I'm sure there'll be more derps than normal. Uh, but uh, I look forward to that. Uh, equal opportunities tractor user. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't want to offend anybody. I like John Deere just as much. Um, let's lower you down. Oh, a bit close over there. does this all the time if you don't lower if you're having this problem if you don't lower the attachment when the um, when the the attachment is highlighted it causes it causes a uh, hassle so let's fold this back up uh, oh no it's not gonna do anything until I connect the PTO and the hydraulics back up let's fold this back up and we'll get that uh, taken off in a minute. You need unloading. Oh, oh, here we go. Here we go. Is he is he done a is he done a unload already? Okay. Let's see if he does an unload. Uh Magnate, how you doing? Hope you're well. Uh, so we set up a course play for him to unload the straw at the TMR station. Uh, so I just want to see if he does it. This could be a mess. You know, the TMR station could be full of straw. Can I see any straw? A big pile of straw in the background over there. Not at the moment. I don't know. We'll have to have a look. Definitely going to have to do a print screen because I haven't got any screenshots today. I keep forgetting. Uh, Ollie, please. How you doing? Uh, another quarter of an hour. 20 minutes, I think. Uh, we've been streaming since one o'clock today. Uh, end of uh, Oakfield. Uh, where are you moving to? Sloth. We're going to. Um, we don't know yet. Is the truth? We have a multiplayer map, um, so uh, we'll be starting that in the beginning. Uh, well, May the second, I think. Saturday, May the second. Uh, Mr. Santosm, how you doing, buddy? I'm very well, thank you. I hope you're well too. Okay. Let's see if he unloads this or he just carries on driving. I don't know. At least he hasn't made a massive uh, pile of straw. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. That didn't work. He's stopped. Let's do it ourselves. There we go. Uh, oh, yeah. Let's lower you. Um, there we go. I am very well. Uh, where are you heading after this? Don't know if I missed your answer. I had to wish a happy birthday to a family member. Oh, Sloth, uh, we, we haven't we haven't uh, figured that out yet. But it's going to be a multiplayer map uh, to try and get you guys involved. Um, and uh, yeah, we're still uh, we're still looking at it. I'm thinking uh, it's going to be Sandy Bay maybe or A another. Uh, but we're going to put the vote to you guys. So 
we'll have a list of sort of five or six maps uh, or four or five depending and uh, we'll let you choose on what the next multiplayer map's going to be uh, and that'll run then for the uh, for the whole of May and uh, I'm going to see if you want to extend it or not um, be a lot of fun right you need uh, unloading there we go Uh, sauce, uh, Brew, Mikey, and apparently me uh, wasn't aware of this, and are trying to find a multiplayer map. Oh, case, yes. Uh, I had a meeting, uh, a meeting with Brew and FS uh, to discuss that. So they've they've known about it for a little while. <laughs> Sorry to put the pressure on. Um, yeah. Whoops. <laughs> Uh, I watched a YouTube last night of a guy that built an actual 737 cockpit uh, with a real-life pilot seat from a 737. The whole setup was 35 grand in his bedroom. Wow. 35,000. I bet it looked amazing. But, yeah. I, I, I do spend silly money on uh, on my FX, uh, you know, flight sim uh, mods. Uh, I do spend probably more than I should. But 35 grand, yeah, that, that, that would uh, definitely go to... Uh, to Mrs. Stocker, or not myself. If I had that sort of money lying around to, you know. Ooh. I bet it looked incredible though, T, didn't it? It looked like the real thing, I bet. Wow. I bet that was awesome. Yeah, I'd consider doing the same with a tractor cab. Oh, really, virtual? I suppose you could pick up a, a tractor cab fairly cheap. You've already got the wheel and everything else, so. I imagine that might be uh, that might actually be feasible uh, on a budget. Right, let's get the. Uh, where are we with fields? Okay, so this is ready for harvesting. We're harvesting this one. Uh, we've collected up all the straw now. Um, I want to do some selling. Uh, let's get over the two hundred thousand mark uh, for today. Where's the big old trailer? Down there. What uh, what we got in our silos? Uh, so we got uh, ten thousand wheat. We got thirty-two thousand uh, barley. Fifteen thousand uh, probably soybean. I think we got sixty-four thousand. We got loads of corn. Uh, not great prices here, though, are they? They're not great prices at the moment. Uh, how much is slurry worth now? Six hundred still at the biogas. Okay. Um, Willowbrook. This sells some soybean at Willowbrook for just under three. Uh, how's the new plane, Stocko? And oh yes, I flew the. Uh, I've got the uh, C90 GTX um, King Air. Uh, I think I think we're going to sell uh, the Cessna uh, C208. You know the new plane that I bought on Friday. Uh, I think we're going to sell that and go for the C90. It's a little bit smaller, but oh, it's such a nice plane to fly. Uh, it's a twin-engine turboprop, so we have to do another check, uh, another check ride, uh, because the check ride that we done before was a single turboprop. So now we have to do the double turboprop. Um, so we have to do another check ride, and then, um, but yeah, it's a it's a cracking plane. It's so it's really really nice. So. Um, We'll, uh, we'll give that a go on Friday. Uh, do the check ride and hopefully do a successful flight from EGDW or EGDI. Um, yeah. Uh, there was a YouTube streamer uh, that has. Oh, right, okay. Uh, soft arms off a shower, make dinner. Uh, take care. Yeah, see you, Sloth. Take care, buddy. I've seen a video of a guy playing Omzi with an actual bus. Wow, that was incredible. Um, also, I'll help wherever I can uh, in my real life farming stuff hosted together. Yeah, Case, I know that, buddy. I know that, mates. Thank you so much. Uh, really appreciate that. Beast, welcome back, Beast. We're, we're going to be shooting off soon. Uh, we're just going to sell some soybean. Try and get, um, try and get the price. Over uh, trying to get our uh, finances over two hundred thousand for t uh, for the day, and I think I'll call that a good day. You know, any day that you got two hundred grand in the bank at the end of the day is a good day. 
I know I've been taking a lot of stick off everybody for uh, you know not having much money in the bank. In fact, who takes soybean? This you, isn't it? Uh, you got plenty. Yeah, we're gonna sell. Oh, that's it. Right. 47,000 litres of soybean. And we're heading to Willowbrook, which is at the top, I believe. Yeah. There we go. So, guys, you know what to do if you're new to the channel. Uh, basically, uh, we have a bit of a guess. And the winner gets a virtual gold star from Stocker Gloss. Uh, guess on how much this was sell for. So, 47,000 litres of soybean. Uh place your bets us giving you a stick surely not oh Sarah no. you wouldn't believe it you wouldn't believe it uh, bloke, uh, the bloke with the bus sim had a had a touch he waited ages for a setter and two turned up at the same time <laughs> oh gosh I like that I like that just like real buses uh, I'm driving and reading chat again sorry Come on, you can do it. See, if this is the John Deere uh, brew, they'd have no trouble getting up this little hill. Uh, oh, the Scots uh, at 14,100. Virtual coming in with a massive 68,000. Gosh. Uh, Hodge, 70,700. Uh, Case at 90. Uh, Matt Rivets at 77,000. Ah. Ants at 66. Beast Gaming coming in at a massive 86 grand. See, oh, Fishy coming in at 68. See what he did there, Fishy. Uh, David Boy at 75. Uh, are these prices the right rules? Uh, closest without go. Oh, gosh. I just need to get there in one piece, I think, without reading, uh, without crashing. I've got uh, AI traffic turned off as well to help me with my uh, chat reading. Clearly, uh, yeah. Price is right, closest without going over. Uh, Dread, just the closest, I think. Um, it's how we've been normally just playing it. Closest wins. NM has gone in at 69,145. Uh, Mr. Sheriff at 65k. Uh, just before we close, phone off 69k, says Sloth. Uh, yeah, it's a prestigious uh, virtual gold star. Stocker Gold Star, so. There's only a few of you that have got them. Uh, Dread at 71,643. That's very precise there, Dread. Uh, Ollie plays at 62k. Cool. That's very precise. <laughs> I got a feeling it's going to be around about the uh, 71,643 mark. But uh, ask me as a better man. I haven't done the calcs. Uh, Country Guy coming in at 68,000. Uh, Dazman at 71,500. That's if we get there, guys. 47,000 litres. 47,000 litres of soybean. What's the selling price? Uh, I literally think the crashes have something to do with the uh, the, ma <laughs> the Massey. Yes, I do. I do, Case. I think if it was a Case, it wouldn't crash, would it? Eh? It would be, uh, it'd be perfectly fine. Uh, Johan coming in at the uh, 78k. Now oh, this is going to be this is going to be tight. Uh, Holly 110k. Oh Holly, I hope so. I hope so. <laughs> All right, here we go then, peeps. The time is here. The time is now. Who's going to get that elusive gold star? Oh, we got lovely money going up. And we're over the 200 mark. Lovely. We're over the 300 mark. Wow. 139,337. 139,337. Guys. Girls, where are we? That was massive. I wasn't expecting it to be that high. 
Uh, Holly at 110. I think you've got it. I think you've got it. Uh, Matt Rivett's gone in at 130. It's too late now, Matt. Too late. <laughs> Uh, Country Go, finally got on Twitch just to see you now. I've been uh, with you since 2011 uh, and wasn't 2013 pharmacy when you started. We can view. Uh, love that. Oh, thank you, Country Guy. Thanks so much for the support for all over the years. Like 10 years, nearly 10 years, buddy. Uh, welcome, man. I'm glad you finally uh, caught me on Twitch. So, um, yeah. So I think, uh, I think, Holly. Holly got that at 110. So everybody give uh, Holly some love. And the virtual ghost star is heading your way. GG. Well done, Holly. Uh, yeah, we got a bit of money for that. Woo! 139,000. Oh, I want to get that. That's a nice amount of money. Yes, uh, I think we're going to do it. Should we sell something? Should we sell some more? I think I've got some more in the uh, in the silo. Uh, soybean. I've got 17,000 soybean. Yeah, 2,900 it was uh, virtual. Um, let's go sell some corn at the Empire Store. Let's go sell some corn. Uh, we're doing a harvest of corn in a minute, so... It'd be nice to get a, a new field without taking a loan. Let's do that. Yeah, before we do that... Uh, Uh, the winner of the Ghost Star is Holly. There we go. Well done, Holly. Where is he? He's over there. That All that money is going to disappear in a very short amount of time. It is indeed the case. It's like real life, isn't it? It takes ages to earn. It takes hard effort to get your money, but so easily spent. Oh. Uh, let's jump into you. Turn you off. Oh, turn you off. And the last thing we do today: go pick up some corn, sell some corn, maybe buy a field, and uh, that probably be it for today. I see a sugar beet harvester. Ah, oh, brew. If you remember at the start of the stream, peeps, uh, for the people that's, uh, that that were there. Uh, I was looking at, uh, oh, I wanted to get into potatoes, uh, potatoes, because um, I've got a potato washer mod and a potato cooking mod for a global company, and um, it doubles the value, so the value of potatoes as it is, and then if you wash them, you get like only 90% of washed potatoes back, but then they're worth double that they were originally, or 40%, I think 40%, and then when you cook them, then they become 40% again. So it works out nearly double uh, if you if you wash your potatoes and cook them and then sell them. So I might, I don't know, I need a new field. Uh, so I think, um, I think I'm going to get a new field, guys. I think that's what we're going to spend the money on. No, do the washer and then the sorter and you get pig food. That's the one, sorry, not the cooker, the sorter I was thinking of, bro. Yeah, and then you get a byproduct of pig food, which then we can load up uh, for our pigs. So, I do want to do potatoes, and we probably will end up doing potatoes, but at the moment, I want another field, a cash crop field, and, um, yeah, so that's what we're doing. Just getting a massive field with loads of soybean on it. Beautiful. Bro, oh man, you have so much to learn. Ah, that's why I play these games. Uh, I'm shocked that he's only had that much. He's just watched uh, vid 115 uh, last night and only had 26,000. And now he has over 325. Impressed. Oh, thank you, country guy. At least there's somebody there, you know, who's supporting me, giving me, uh, you know, giving me the love that's due. Because um, in any simulation game, whether it's uh, farming sim, flight sim, uh, truck sim, I tend to just go in debt. I just buy, you know, borrow from the bank and then just never pay it back. You know, I'm, I'm terrible. But uh, we set ourselves a little challenge at the start of the map, uh, start of the series. Uh, the whole of April, we've been playing Oakfield single player with the help of you and Zachary and 
Mary Jane. Um, well, whatever money we make, uh, we're going to uh, keep for the multiplayer map, uh, which will be starting on the 2nd of May. Uh, I'll never give you support, just grind you down. Thank you, Brew. I appreciate that, buddy. Whiskey Man, how you doing? Uh, we still off a truck in Thursday. Yes, yes, we are. Um, good news is, I should have my G29 wheel here tomorrow morning. Uh, so I'll set that up. Uh, I've got Toby track eye set up as well. So, yeah, it should be interesting uh, to see all that working. Uh, we'll be the Pro Mods 2.45, and we'll do some trucking. Uh, yeah, I'm looking forward to it. It'll be good. <clears throat> Alright, let's sell some more corn. Uh, food time, see you tomorrow. Brew, take care, buddy. Thank you, mate. See you tomorrow. Ooh, G29. Yes, yes, I'm looking forward to it. I had a, I had a choice between a G29 and a new chair. And the G29 one. Uh, I do need a new chair, though, so I'm going to have to get a new, new chair next, next month. Okay, 47,000 litres of corn. Now, where are we selling this at? Um, over here, okay. So, go there, guys. 47,000 litres of corn. You know what to do. Take your best guess at what that will sell for. Uh, Stocker's gone posh. <laughs> Whiskey. <laughs> no. Stucco and Porsche do not go in the same uh, in the same sentence there, Whiskey Man. David Boy's going in at 60k. Cool. Virtual going at 68. Uh, Matt's at 69. Oh, this is a lot closer. Uh, Kid are coming in at 75. Country Guy at 63k. Uh, Dazman at 73. It's a lot closer this time. You're seeing it's around in there, sort of 60 to 70. Hodge coming in at 56,400. Uh, Mr. Sheriff at 70k. Bang on. Uh, Beast Gaming at 95. Oh, I hope so, Beast. That'd be brilliant. Uh, NM at 71,113. NM. That's a bit too precise there, buddy. Uh, Ant. 100k flat. Oh, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Uh, I'll send a link to the uh, chair I got stuck at. It might work for you. Oh, Case. Thank you, mate. Um, that'd be uh, that'd be brilliant. Thank you. For corn, fifty k. Oh, we'll have to see. We got forty-seven thousand liters of corn. Uh, Johan's going in at thirty-seven. Bit low there, Johan. Yeah. Uh, country guy with the follow. Thank you, mate. Welcome to the channel. Uh, Jason at 55 grand. Uh, Jason, I think that's a bit low, buddy. I'm, I'm, th I'm thinking around the 60 mark. Me, if I was a betting man. Uh, the Goblin. Uh, the Goblin going in at 85. God, I hope so. This John Deere doesn't, uh, you know, doesn't struggle up this hill like this Massey does. He'll get up there in a minute. Poojan going in with a half a million. <laughs> yeah, well, you never know. You never know. You could be in the in the running for the you know with the virtual gold star. <laughs> uh, by the time we get there, we'll have to adjust our guess. <laughs> in them, I'm trying. This thing's, uh, yeah, it's not as powerful as a John Deere. I should uh, do some more screenshots. There we go. We're starting to level off now. Uh, can we go first person camera? Pujan, yes we can. Uh, I love the wind mirrors. Uh, you, see, you can see the grain uh, behind the... Uh, uh, in, the uh, in the trailer behind. Right. 
47,000 litres of corn. Good luck to everybody with that gold star. Let's see what we get. We have got... Uh, 67,463. 67463. Call it up. Who's the closest? 67463. 67463. 674. Virtual at 68. 674. I think Virtual's got it, you know. Uh, anybody else? Are you thinking? Uh, Tom, hey Stocko, uh, just uh, being back after fixing my PC uh, and an hour and a half to uh, blue screening. What's been happening? Whoa, look at that money. Oh yes, we've been selling we, We've been selling that slurry that I was uh, busy uh, taking to the... Um, taking to the uh, BGA. Uh, so we uh, managed to sell that and uh, sold some corn. Uh, sorry, some soybean and we just sold some corn. And we've got 390. Uh, so virtual farmer uh it's just got time to hate by my uh, my bot sorry buddy uh there we go virtual gold star heading your way buddy give some love in the chat for virtual farmer uh thank you very much uh, it's, it's heading its way now and uh, guys give him a follow give him a like he's a great lad uh as the same with mr t uh, johnny uh sloth uh, loads of them uh, we've had an amazing amount of content creators in our in our chat today so just first, uh, just a massive thank you to everybody uh, today. It's been awesome. Uh, but we're going to leave. Uh, we're going to leave that there. I'm going to roll the credits uh, and then uh, we'll uh, go on a raid. Um, if you guys are up for it. Uh, again, a little bit of a disclaimer. I don't know uh, the raider. I don't know uh, what the language is like. Uh, so uh, if you're not into your fruity language or 18 plus language, uh, then. Uh, please don't raid. Uh, but everybody else, uh, let's go make someone's day and give them a smile and uh, pass on this goodwill that uh, everybody else has been passing on to me. So, Virtual Farmer, thank you. Everybody, thank you so much for the support and love today. I'll see you all tomorrow with some trucking Thursday. Hey, Tom Fy, thank you so much for the follow. And, um, and yeah, I'll see you all tomorrow. Ciao for now.